and also shrapnel, which would lead you to believe that he had some device. They were throwing explosive devices out of the car. To give you an idea of where we are here so that you can you know, know Watertown. You, you all know Watertown, but how close we are. We're very near the Lexus of Watertown. Okay, you're right there. You're going to you know, kind of hang that left if you're, if you're, going, uh, if you're going east and, and go right up there. Dexter Avenue shoots off there, juts off, and right down the street, Laurel and Oaks. So and we're very near the Lexus of Watertown as uh, they are going house to house with this older model sedan that's behind that SWAT truck. We've seen throughout the morning one door ajar, the driver door open, um, and they are searching for this suspect number two. And this search is made that much more intense by news that I'm sure they have been relayed, all these officers, that one of the suspects believed to have an IED strapped to him. So this guy's running out of options. He is cornered. Wherever he is, there's, there's nowhere for this guy to go. And it could be, uh, obviously, uh, a, a situation where this guy's a walking bomb. Uh, and if that's the case, these guys walk in there and find him, and, and you know it's not as simple as you know put your hands up. So this is this is as intense as it gets.